Up until about a year ago, my life was pretty normal. I lived in the greatest place ever, Brooklyn. Represent, had two cool parents, and loved all things science and superheroes. Everything changed though, when my dad was killed in the city hall bombing. I, I couldn't believe he was gone. But Peter Parker and his Aunt May, they were there for me. And so was Spider-Man, who I later found out was Pete. Crazy, right? Then when the Devil's Breath crisis started, things got intense. It seemed like all of Spidey's villains were on the loose. I managed to do my part to help him out. And after all that, believe it or not, a spider bit me. And I started to change. I didn't want to worry my mom, so I went to Pete. And now, we're officially Spider Bros. He's been training me up, and I'm actually getting pretty good with this whole web swinging thing. I'm still learning to juggle this responsibility with everything else in my life. School, friends, a new home. I moved to Harlem a few weeks back. But I'll tell you, I can't wait to see what the future holds. That is so cool. I got you. Hey, thanks. No problem. Hey, uh, you think you're gonna add that new Spider-Man too? The key? Yeah. Maybe. Original's just my guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case. Octopus-related flaws have been fixed. Let's hope. Okay, closing in on you. Be there soon. Should let mom know I'll be late. Mayo, get that. Did you get the shopping list? Hey, mom. Uh, yeah, but uh, the bodega was out of coconut milk. Gonna check a store downtown. Oh, thank you. But avoid made town. That prison convoy is making traffic a nightmare. Oh yeah, good call. You at dinner, Mom. Man, how does Pete do this secret identity thing? It completely stresses me out. Be cool. 
Helping Spider-Man protect a giant prison convoy? You can handle this. Breathe in, breathe out. Be cool. Pete, you here? Just down in some rocket fuel. How are you drinking? Very, very carefully. Okay, go time. Helix 2 en route, heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2, we've got you on scope. This is a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances, especially not with our guest of honor. Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Ock is in there? I think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion, could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. Hold back, Miles. Let me take. I got this beat. Don't worry. Oh, no! <laughs> it's secure. It's okay, we got this. Just need to contain it before... Before that happens. Hello, tiny spiders. Oh! 
Crack crap the winter bath! This is starting to feel real bad, man. Uh, don't think like that. We're going to stop him. As long as we work together. Speaking of, mind giving me a hand up here? Yeah. Yeah, I got you. Okay, Pete. Yeah, I got this. Take it away, Capo. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait, that's the ball. Hang on tight, tiny spider. Spider-Man, hey, I need a little help. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Got you. And you're safe. My fishing here on the Volga! That sounds nice! A power over life and death! Oh, it excites me! Left nice! Gotcha! Thank you! You're welcome! Don't care, baby! Christmases, I was locked behind 30 feet of steel. I intend to enjoy this one. He's a menace. Uh, too soft. He's a low energy menace. Too easy. Maybe he's a weak minded. Oh. Hey, Jonah, looking good. Very fast. Menace. A feckless, treacherous, unhinged menace. Get out of here. Hey, Mom! Yeah, coconut milk. Still trying to find it. Been kind of, uh, an adventure. Are you running? Yeah, uh, sorry. Trying to catch a train. Mira, mijo. No seas mentiros. You got the milk in hurry, home? Sí, ma. Te quiero mucho. Yo también te quiero. Now we're never miles. We gotta stop him. On my way. We gotta bring him down fast. Yeah, yeah. What do we do? Let us raise temperature. Oh, bad, bad, very bad. Pete, are you okay? Pete! 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 
Wake up. Wake up, wake up, man. Wake up, man. This Spider-Man is broken. I would like to exchange for new one. Ah. This one will do. Miles, get out of here! Guys, wow, just, <laughs> wow. Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. And you too. Uh, sorry, I think our ball landed in your yard. No, actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But it uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you, both of you. Taken down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks. But he, he's still dangerous. Nah, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until mm, something like this happens. Oh, duty calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you both. <laughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. Hey. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Bioelectricity. Wow. Gotta be honest. A little jealous. Hey, look. I got nothing on the OG. Think we should run tests tomorrow? A little voltage analysis? Oh... Man, 
Yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you, I'm not gonna be around for the next few weeks. Is this some kind of pee joke I don't get? No. Uh, MJ's headed overseas for the Bugle and requested me as her photographer. Kind of a working vacation for us. Oh, man. Look, I don't know if I'm ready to fly solo. I screwed up today big time with the helicopter. But then you delivered big time. You saved my bacon, Miles. I got lucky. Hey, I did this gig for eight years without backup, and you better believe I screwed up lots of times. But that is how you learn. What's this? Christmas present. But first, you gotta take the oath. Oh. Um, okay. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this city. I promise. That's it? That oath a real thing. Totally. Definitely didn't just make it up. See you in a few weeks, Spider-Man. New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. Please don't screw this up. The city late at night hit a pedestal. Shining on my rather than for long, but that was on the game. They know the true form of pure evil is invisible, so I keep a lot of vision. Every night I try to reach you, but I see you see your eyes. Don't let me catch you, I will waste your time. Now I know there's no more. My thoughts open wide. Here it goes. Hold up in my throat. Here it goes. Yo, Genki. Dude. Rhino? What? <laughs> yeah. Where you at? You get into the apartment okay? Yeah. Your mom let me in. Unpacked slash dumped my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park, grabbing some air. Oh, perfect. Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this spider related? Please tell me you got a piece of Rhino's horn or something. Pics I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts. <laughs> definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. Oh. Loving the suspense. I'm there. Probably waiting at the amphitheater for me. I will never get used to you doing that. Hey, look, check it. Christmas present from Spider Man. Open it. Dude, put it on. I'll cover you. What? Never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Whoa. Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. Head up down for part two of this amazing gift. This is only half of the present. What's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Welcome to Just a Fact with me, your truth slinging host with the most, J. Jonah Jameson. What? This Pete said it suits the autoplay Jameson show? Guys, a masochist. Sad news, listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular 
was canceled due to masked vigilante mayhem. Gotta be something better on. <sighs> Been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Danica Hart, and this is the Danicast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in our city. Today's topic, well, you know, stockbrokers, for-profit colleges, make internet videos autoplay. <laughs> No, obviously we're covering the Spider-Man's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe, Danicast, new favorite podcast. <laughs> this is the place. Looks like Pete set up a lot of gear. training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your terms is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. And now a personal favorite, the swing kick. This holotech is next gen. With the right parts, but I can make it portable. Alert. Parker. Now let's combine these two moves. Contacting <laughs> airborne enemies is a great method of crowd control. Plus, sounds they make her hilarious. Woo! Splash! Splash! Got something for you! Tech gear we can sell. Uh, oh crap. Spider! Take them out! Then grab the gear! Y'all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Okay, let's go! Take the spider out and grab the tech gear! Gonna make banks selling this stuff off! Just so you know, this is official Spider-Man tech! Y'all are not authorized to resell! Super Spider Entertainment System Online. Gaining speed. Oh, Welcome to Advanced Training. Remember, specificity is the heart of every criticism. For example, instead of just a ugly, try... Oh, nice mask! Wait, that, that's your face? Uh, that's not a quip! That's a straight-up burn! 
That's it for the tech thieves. Now to fix a training sim. Colonel Panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice! That did it. it. Looks like P made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. check out Roxxon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah, I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we gotta name it. How about venom power? You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, Venom Power. Trust me, it's gold. Hey, friends. Thank you so much for telling people about this podcast. We've jumped the charts from 136 to 87. Like, uh, wow. <laughs> okay, okay, moving. Today I'm doing a quick cast before I head downtown for my citizenship test, and I'm answering fan DMs. First one, where are you from, Jessica? Well, I was born in Guzhou, China, but we came to New York when I was six. Next question, what kind of mic do you use? Uh, purple one? I'm just kidding, <laughs> the link's on my phone. Uh, okay, question three. What's the point of your podcast? Okay, so once a week, I get coffee with my friend, a journalist turned lobbyist. We talk about the news, and while we don't always agree, having to defend what I think makes me prep better. It keeps me informed and gives me a chance to revise my gut reactions. So I thought, what if everybody had that friend? What if I could be that friend for them? That's why I'm here. Ooh, and I should head to the subway. Thanks for listening, and remember that being overly familiar on social media is not cool. Okay, bye! Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuvorn. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? Hmm. No sign of anybody. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. 
They did a search for new food. What were they gonna do with it? <laughs> Farm shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. They were tracking new form shipments, but why? Rock's on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. <laughs> 